and transformed into unshakable oracles of virtue. But my eyes scanned the universe and from the last form of dialogue I overheard, it made me assume that you have forgotten your value. You are now too concerned about contouring your features and wearing the tightest form of clothing to attract your desired other halves. Your assets are constantly on show and classiness and privacy has become alien and something relatively unknown all to secure a ring which you have not studied the meaning of. Your builders, carriers of glory, yet focusing on your career in this day and age is something that is not promoted. Ambition is frowned upon, as if too much of it makes you an entity of intimidation. So you lessen yourself to fit in, and validation of your external beauty is something that is detrimental to you to feeling good within. Your confidence is in your Instagram likes, or how many boys think you're sexy or nice, as it's normal in this day and age, right? Wrong. When did being robbed of your virtue become a normality? I believe you are far more precious than rubies and gold, and should be operating in a spirit of excellence, and not lingering near the lines of satisfactory. Because the truth is, you're never satisfied. Because of your inner insecurities that you never dealt with. Your heart is often melted when you scroll through that girl's Instagram page and you compare your skin tone and features to her, in your mind, perfect face. But of course you'll never discuss your dirty habits or secret crave to anyone because you look unstable and, and you're confident, right? Right? Wrong. I hate when I hear the statement said to women, someone's always going to be prettier than you. By whose standard, I always wonder. Who defined this beauty that we crave? The media and society have us as puppeteers in this never-ending destructive play of light versus dark and thick versus slim, all seeds sown prior to time by evil minds to bring separation. I remain faithful to my word and salute every girl standing up and making a difference. And if you haven't recognized your light still, open your eyes and listen within as you're a queen on the go and you possess absolutely everything. <laughs>